Hey everyone, welcome back to Procrastination Population 292. Today we're back playing some more Banjo 2. We're making our way downtown, walking fast. Walking fast. Faces flash and I'm homebound. I uh, I made the unfortunate discovery today. Uh, by the way, last time we beat uh, most of, if not all of, excuse me? You think you can't, you think you can hide that from me? Uh, last time we beat most of, if not all of, it. Eh, eh. Look at that. Greatest of all time. Last time we beat most of, if not all of, um, not all of, I don't know why I'm saying that. We beat most of the Mayan level. Uh, we have a couple more things we need to do, but we don't have the abilities to do them yet, so we'll come back in the future. But we also unlock the next two levels, uh, one of which we'll see today. We might actually be able to see the other one today if we go in here. I think we actually can. I think this connects to Witchy World. It sounds kind of witchy. Oh, this is definitely a look at that. We also found another missile silo, the Isla Hag's Pine Grove back away. Excuse me, sir. There are musical notes here to be had. So we can actually just like skip the second level completely and be like, I'm not interested. Uh, let's open this thing. Boosh. Now we have a quicker way to get from, from place A to place B in the future if we want to. Anything back here? There's a wigwam here. Oh, I remember what this is. I was like, why are you outside of the level? But I now recall what this is. Let's go talk to our, our, our main lady, Wumba. How is it going? Ooh, it's to get the slow motion pan. What's she saying? I have a very special spell, but need legendary Mega Globo. Let me guess. I bet there's only one of these Mega Globo things, and it's real hard to find. Bird correct. Now go and find. You not have Mega Globo. Return when due. All right, so can't do anything here yet, but once we can... Look at that Mega Globo. Once we can, that's... It's, this is one of my favorite things about this entire game. But unfortunately, it's not unlocked yet. We can look over here at the Flume of Doom. We're gonna learn another, I assume, type of eggs. Yes, for blasting things, these eggs were made. Don't stand close when you fire a grenade. Okay, so we now have grenade eggs as well. Uh, which obviously we shoot and blow things up. That'll be all. Tan hut dismissed. Get it on, you know what I'm saying? Uh, so obviously, yo, this dude's swooping in like a bird. Uh, obviously, excuse me. Obviously, those are pretty good. And I wonder if we can use those to break the big rocks. Let's go find out. I don't think we can. And we definitely can't do anything with that yet. How did the freaking digger get underground? Couldn't tell you, but it did. So don't worry about it. Do we get more bubbles as the game goes on? Because I feel like that's not a lot of bubbles. Oh, well. Uh, anyway, we're going to be going to uh, a new world today. A whole new world. Aladdin sung about it. Or maybe Jasmine did. Is that her name? The princess? I don't know. I don't watch Disney movies. Um, I had my world rock today. Do you ever like... Have you ever like just been not listening to a song, but you, you've known a song for your entire life and what you thought were the lyrics turn out to not be the lyrics? Have you ever had that happen to you? All right, I want to see if this works. If I shoot this at this... No, we, we have to have the special move. All right, that, that's fine. Um, but have you ever had that happen to you where the, the lyrics that you thought were the lyrics turn out to not be the lyrics and then everything you know is a lie? Anything up here? Anything we can reach up here? I don't think so, but there's a missile silo I didn't even activate, so let's go ahead and activate that. Uh, yeah, I had that today with um, freaking Feel Good Ink by the the Gorillas, And I'll tell you what, the, the move... The, the lyric that I had wrong is actually really just dumb on my part, and I don't know why I would have thought it was originally this other lyric. Welcome to Glitter Gul Gulch Mine, where we mine gulches of glitter. Uh, we also have enough Cheeto pages to unlock our first cheat if we want to. There's our first warp pad. Anything else here in the beginning? Might as well open these. <gasps> these are springy step shoes, but you'll have to come and find me before you can use them. Tan hut, this myth. Oh, uh, we can use these though. <laughs> uh, I'm sure we get to use these at some point, but I'm not ready to use them now, so just get rid of them. Um, the lyric I, I thought, or at least I thought I knew, that turned out to be wrong. I literally, by the way, it's been so long since I've done Glitter Gulch Mine, although I will say the track is lit. It has been such a long time. It's been such a long time uh, that I literally don't even remember how to do pretty much any of this stuff, so just, just a heads up. Um was in the second no it's in the it's when the rapping starts and he says don't stop get it get it until you blank for some reason 
Does this hurt me? Definitely does. For some reason, and I do not have an explanation for my own idiocy, I was 100% convinced that the lyric was, don't, or here, here's what the actual lyric, lyric is. The lyric is, don't stop, get it, get it, until you jet ahead and watch the way I navigate. Ah, ha, 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 ha. For some reason, and I don't know why, I thought the lyric was, don't stop, get it, get it, until you're cheddar heading. If go listen to it right now, you're probably thinking that's stupid. Why would it be that? What's a freaking cheddar head? I wondered the same thing myself. Does this not work? I feel like this should work. I feel like lighting the fuse like this should hurt. So light it up, 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 light it up, up, up. Apparently not. Grenade fuse? Do you want a grenade fuse maybe? I mean, I feel like these should, you know, physically would make sense to work, but uh, the game decides what's true physics. What's in here, by the way? We open this yet? Oh god. Bleep! I'm trapped in this mine by that block tunnel. That bleep. Okay, so I guess we can't free him yet. Maybe we do this with the uh the ground pound ability that we're gonna get. Maybe it creates a spark or something that excuse me. Maybe it creates a spark or something that gets it done. I have no idea. I also don't know why this radioactive pond is here. Shout out to uh, what are they called? Magic Dragons. Remember when they were a thing? I remember that. Dude, it's so sad to see these, like, bands pop up. And I wouldn't really consider Imagine Dragons a rock band. But I would say they're, like, as far as in popular music goes, probably as close. And I'm, I'm a fan of rock music, so it's... Oh, my God, look at this beautiful site where we can see... How do you... There was a way to get rid of this. I would like the eggs to go away. We can see Mumbo's eye just like peeping out over the distance. The, the distance. I can go the distance. I'll be there someday. Never seen Mulan. Is that from Mulan? Could be. Uh, the only reason I'm coming back here is for my own selfish purposes. I would like to get a shot of the Glitter Gulch Mine. Glitter Gulch Mine. Look at that. I'm a little too close, I think. I need to come from further back. You gotta get thumbnail shots, right? You can't blame me for that. Glitter Gulch Mine. Looking good. All right, that's our thumbnail. Cool. Thanks so much. Bye. I wish I could, like, get us on. I probably could if I did the same thing I did before and just did the, like, jump over to here and then got on top of this thing. All right. Well, can we, like, zoom out maybe? Can we zoom out further back? No. No. Not allowed. I would love to get Banjo in the picture. Maybe if we did, like, let's do, like, a little jump and let's do, like, that could be a good thumbnail. How's that look? Oh my god. Get the right turning point. I'm sure I can pause it at some point in there and be like, Glitter Gulch Mine! Welcome to, welcome to Glitter Gulch Mine! Here we are in Glitter Gulch Mine! Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Okay. One of those in there is gonna be good. I'll deal with it. Okay. Let's start exploring. First things first, I'm the realist. We're gonna press this button and what's it gonna do? When I come for you? gonna do something down downstream what's going on down river here down by the river um something's gonna get opened yes that's gonna get opened but i think it's timed 35 seconds so unfortunately i was supposed to get the speedy shoes and then do it so oh global alert global alert let's go ahead and get the global because we will need it for later i don't know that i'm ready to transform just yet i think i'd like to get a little bit uh Get a little bit, give a little bit of your love to, actually, I actually do remember what the transformation in this one is, and I remember now how to blow up that TNT barrel for later. Okay, can't do anything with this yet, but maybe our good friend Mumbo could help us out. We'll go ahead and step on this. One second, time's up. I figured they'd play that song that's like, you failed, you're the worst at this game. They didn't though. Okay, what's in here? Oh god, this scared me to death for some reason. Alright. This is in here, but we... I'm pretty sure there's just no reason to go in here yet, so I'm not going to. I'm pretty sure we need Mumbo to do his thing first. And then maybe if Mumbo does his thing, maybe we can do our thing, you know what I'm saying? And what is our thing? Pretty much letting Kazooie do all the work for us. All right, we got Mine Entrance 1 here. Let's see what's in Mine Entrance 1. This is going to be a lot of exploration, basically, to try to 
basically expect that anytime we go into a new level, the first time, ah, that was close. The first time through is pretty much solely gonna be exploration and trying to remember what the heck happens in this game because it's, you know, it's been a, a decent amount of time for me. And then the second time through will be, I will probably, at least I would endeavor to be a little bit more methodical, hello. Uh, be a little bit more methodical about what the heck I'm doing and actually knowing, oh, you need five pages. Five pages at last, come see me in Grunty's old lair in Spiral Mountain. And I'll tell you your first secret cheats. Dude, if this was Isaac, we could blow up this mushroom, get magic mushroom. That'd be pretty exciting. Can I step in this water? It looks gross. Apparently we can, and apparently there's music notes down here, so I am totally down for that. I don't know why Banjo-Kazooie is like one of the few games that the underwater levels don't really, I mean, they still freak me out, don't get me wrong. I'm having a minor panic attack right now, but they don't freak me out as much as water does in some other games. I don't, maybe it's because I played this as I was a kid, so I remember when there's sharks and when there's not, and believe me, when there are sharks, Jolly, oh, Jolly Roger Lagoon Water. Is that in this, I think that's in this game. I think that's a reference to, please though. I think that's a reference to something else in this game. Or maybe a connection between the levels. There's a lot of those in this game, so it wouldn't surprise me if it was that either. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we can't get up there. There's something that leads to it. In Oh, God, he's trying to snipe me. In Jolly Roger's Lagoon. Like, I hear the Jinjo, but I'm pretty sure we just can't get him yet. It's okay, though. Moving along. Freaking all the other American reject style. Because all I've got to keep is strong. Okay, Waterfall Cavern. See, like, this water freaks me out a little bit more because it looks like something could live in here. Like, I could see, like, the Loch Ness Monster calling itself home here. It looks like we also just can't do anything in here either. I think this is another area that connects. Yeah, I can't get up there for sure. Yeah, there's definitely no way up there. All right, it's okay. Don't worry. This may seem like an immense failure thus far. We haven't done anything. We're 12 minutes in, and I've done nothing in this entire level. I can promise you I'm just setting you up for the freaking greatest Tom brady S comeback in the second half or the second episode, whatever it is. But we're going to get all the jiggies, all them jiggies. But for now, let's keep exploring because this level is beautiful and I just love Glitter Gulch Mine in general. Basically, anything with alliteration, you're going to get bonus points from me. Okay, there's something behind the waterfall there. Yeah, if you guys would just like stay underground. I don't know how you unburrow yourselves so quickly, by the way. It's quite remarkable. Now, the main question is, can we use the bear grip and get up there? I don't think so. I was like, maybe, but now I'm thinking probably not. What do we got in here? Nothing, just a waterfall, just a very flat waterfall. And I'm pretty sure like literally nothing else we can do in here. Okay, I see your game game. You know what? We're gonna play the games game and we are going to do the thing that I messed up the first time. Uh, there's another TNT thing. There's a lot of TNT things. I can't help but notice. Uh, we also got some notes over here. Okay, we're getting there. Oh, let's go ahead and get our ability. Because I, I feel like this ability is going to come in so clutch for us. So let's just get it and be happy about it. Let's uh, jump up there if we could. And I think it's right here. Okay. I've been duped, but maybe further up. Can you take me higher? into the mine where is jam jar seriously where the heck is this dude on this roof is he across the way you son of we'll come in here first i'm pretty sure he's gonna be crying if i remember oh i told you this dude's a little whiner what's the matter howdy who might you be i'm bill I'll bet your other name is gold related. What is it? Gold bar Bill? Klondike Bill? Nope. Bullion Bill's the name. Thought so. <laughs> What's up, Bill? My rodent partner Dilberta went looking for gold, but she's been gone far too long. We'll keep a lookout for her. Not so fast, Banjo. Make sure he makes it worth our while. Oh, okay. Can we have a prize if we find her? You city folk are all like, I wonder where she could be. I wonder where she could be. Where's Dilberta? Eek, I'm sure I came in through a tunnel. We've already found Delberta. Don't need to reintroduce me to her. Oh my God, it's freaking frozen. So if you go through here, we can see something amazing. And that is that, whoa, it's the rock. Delberta's on the other side. If you listen to the music. Oh, 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 oh. We're, oh my God, every time I do that, this shakes. I need to get rid of this freaking giant mug. 
It doesn't do anything for me. I've never used it once. Uh, but basically that now we have a, a connection between levels. You'll find that there's a lot of those level connections in this game in general. Guff beans! Dude, that sounds like the nastiest thing you could ever eat in your entire life. What you have for dinner? Oh, some guff beans. Mmm! I love me some guff beans. Okay, let's go ahead and get this, please. Thank you. And then let's fly across the way and not get hurt. Although it's not looking great for us. Oh, we've survived. Excuse me, there's a guy that's yeehawing in my general direction, and that's not something I allow unless we've gone on at least one date. All right, open this up. 85 coins, 85 notes. Give me ability. Build drill. This makes breaking so much fun. Now listen how it's done. Leap high in the air, and then hold Z. Watch Kazooie spin and drill with her head. Did that rhyme? This missed. I don't think that rhymed. You should definitely be fired from your job. Uh, okay, so with this new ability, pretty greatest. Have you ever backflipped off of nothing? Kazooie can. Uh, with this, we just do this. You just hold it for longer, and you can now spin and explode like that and get a honeycomb for free. I mean, we had to pay for it, kind of, by getting the move. But pretty much for free. It's epic. Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep exploring. And see what else this level has to offer. Just some big old piles of... You know what. Of course I'm talking about... Uh, Jinjo? Jinjo? Jinjo in the tunnel, perhaps? Is he in the tunnel? I can't remember. Hello? Oh, you are the greatest. Hello. One of eight. Purple Jinjo, thank you so much for coming along. Now, we gotta be careful because once we get a little bit later, the Jinjos aren't always as kind as... Uh, Maybe a man like me would want them to be. You'll you'll find out with that. I mean, you'll you'll see eventually. A lot of rhyme in there, and I wasn't a huge fan of it. I'm typically a fan of rhymes, but not when I bust them. Please, though. Please, Banjo, Kazooie, and your little chicken legs. I mean, your legs are much stronger than they were in levels past, so I gotta give that to you. What is this? Mine entry two? Cool, but first we want to check on Mumbo and see what he's doing. We don't want to be Mumbo just yet. Although, where's this Globo? Is this one? I can't remember. I think this one's inside your house. I can't remember. Is it? Hello? Any Globos up in here? Glo any Globos like chilling up here next to Mumbo? No? Not behind? He's not hiding up here anywhere? Well, we'll have to find this Globo because, I mean, we could use the Globo that we got from Wumba. Of course, we could use the, 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 the global that we got from Wumba. Oh, God, please. We could use that and um, and do stuff with that. But also, I feel like, why? So, we'll, we'll find his. It's got to be around here somewhere. Uh, my basic idea, like, for this game is... Each episode, basically... Oh, that was pretty hard to find. Um, is pretty much do, like... Episode one of coming into an area area is just exploration and trying to figure out what the heck is uh, What the heck's around what this game has to offer episode two doing like Mumbo stuff and anything else we can do and then episode three doing Wumba stuff and finishing things up So if we can stick to that kind of script, that'd be pretty awesome. So is this the first? Can't do that, huh? This might be the f first Jinjo that's a meanie let me check, though. Let me check. We're gonna just do a little test here. Can I shoot through this? No. What about if I come from this angle? If I come from this side? They scare me so much in this game, and you'll freaking see what... It's impossible to tell right now. I'm gonna assume he's friendly. Not that there's evil ones, but maybe there's evil ones. Maybe. Let's break this boulder. I like this boulder. That's a nice boulder. Where am I? I do not know where I am. Sam I am. But we're gonna freaking find out. Can I get up there? <gasps> Doesn't look like it. Even with my greatest jump, I don't think I can get up there. Okay. I saw something on the ground over here though, so I'm a little nervous. I'm like, my camera angle's not really cooperating. Oh, it's this thing. That's okay. He can't hit me. Oh, God. Don't worry about me. Just doing my job. Just clearing some rocks, ma'am. Or late, or, or male, for person, man. Whoever you may be. Can't use those yet. We'll be able to eventually. Anything up here? This seems like a decent little hiding spot. What's going on up here? 
who left this sign for me. Pressing the control stick only slightly will make you tiptoe silently. Which I guess means we're gonna have to use that at some point? So I don't see where it greatest. Um, it sucks that those things come back. I mean, I can understand it, and it's kind of nice from an HP perspective, but I also hate it. Okay, tiptoeing will make you crouch silently. If we have to do that thing again where I gotta change the control setting so I can tiptoe, please tell me I don't have to do that in here. The power hut. What's going on in the power hut? I mean, I'm assuming this is where direct power comes from. What do we got up here? Trying to hide something from me? Seems like it. What is it? A button. I mean, I'd like to press it. Cool. What's it do? Turn on the power, off the power. Probably on. Power hut basement. All right. That looks slightly treacherous, but I see a jiggy. And if we can get a single jiggy in this episode, I'll at least feel better about myself. Please tell me not. Are you kidding me, though? It's one of these where... I don't think I need the light to do that. I could, like... What if I, like, butt bombing? Stay down forever. Alright, apparently not one of those. Hmm. <laughs> I'm sure there's a way to get it to stay down by, like, dropping something on it or dropping it like it's hot. But I'm part of the group of people that think we can do this without being able to see. Maybe. Don't get me wrong, the music's a little scary. But we don't need lights. Who said we need lights? I did not say that. There's just enough light here to see where I'm supposed to be going. This is the easiest thing I've ever done in my young platforming career. Although sometimes in the middle it looks like there's no board there and it kind of freaks me out. But look at this speed run. Pretty much the fastest I've ever seen someone complete a level. Where's this light coming from? The magical jiggy? I don't think so, but that's 11 for us. Or 10. That's only 10, just kidding. Okay, does that actually mean there's, I think that actually means there's two more Jiggies in the first level that we need to get, because we get one before we even go into a level, so I think we actually have two more Jiggies to get, which kind of sucks, but that's okay. So I don't really know what the power is for, other than, yeah, like literally I have no idea. Can I climb those things? Can I climb these things? Doesn't seem like they go anywhere, so let's just pretend it's not nothing and not worry about it because the less you worry about in life the longer you live it's a study done by bill Nye the science guy so i can prove it source huffington post slash buzzfeed very reliable sources i promise okay done in the power hut we got one jiggy i still feel kind of bad about it, how slow i've handled this level and it's probably going to take more than three to get through it but you know what doesn't matter. There's also going to be a lot of backtracking. I can already promise you that. However, uh, is this the way we came from? This looks new. This is very new. Generator Cavern. Hello. Warning, unreliable generators use at your own risk. This is new. I'm assuming... If I shoot eggs into them... Different kinds of eggs? Different kinds of eggs? Gotcha! Okay, but I'm, I'm assuming the unreliable part means that they're not going to last forever. Like, it'll probably last for, like, enough time for me to start walking. Or maybe they're going to... Yeah, okay, they go off. Okay. Easy peasy. That's no issue. Oh, God. This is a little more treacherous, but that's no biggie. We're getting our freaking... Ability to see back today. Excuse me. I tried to shoot that right in there. Oh god. Now we got gaps Oh, now we got gaps. The gaps are a little scarier. Where am I going? Where am I going? Okay, I can see this. Okay. Oh You don't understand. I was not prepared, but I can still see a little bit and I mean just a little bit How was I supposed to get through this whole section in two seconds? Who built this? You missed some pieces. Oh My god, please do your job right next time right in there. I don't know what this does for me, but we can definitely get this jiggy and say thank you so much, and then I can come down here and see what's down here. No generator, I need you to not go off. Is this just back at the start? 
Yes, could we not just go... No, please. Could we not just go this way to start with? And I'm the worst? Apparently not. I, I thought I saw a putty tat? I thought I saw something else in there, though. That had me a little freaked out. Hold on, I'm gonna... I just wanna check. I just wanna check. I don't think I missed anything. But it seemed like there was another generator in an area that we didn't ever reach. But maybe I'm crazy. Does that make me crazy? Yeah, like that. What's that generator over there doing? How does one get to that? How does one get to that generator is what I want to know. You just climb this all the way? Or that generator? Where the heck are those? You see what I'm seeing? Are you seeing what I'm saying? Oh, God, that was close. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? I'm assuming... That because this one's red, it will illuminate the way to the other ones. But where? Now, do you, do you like move something? What have you done? Or all of them have red. What What is that generator over there is what I'm asking. If I fly to that, I don't think I can make that. I don't think I can make that. And we never went there, right? Like, look at it. There's nothing around. Excuse me, guy. I'm trying to observe here. Yeehaw! Let me try one more time. Just trying to take a peek here at what you even illuminate for me. Because there's one way over there, too, that we can't really see. Alright, I'm going to go for it, and if I die, I die. I didn't even jump. We definitely could have made that. I should have save-stated. I'm the worst human being of all time. I'm playing it on an emulator. You got to use that too. Are you kidding me? Prospector's Hut? I'm feeling just like you, man. Are you kidding me? That's so far back. Okay. On the bright side, I think we keep the Jiggy. Like, I don't think we lost the Jiggy from doing that. But I think we're going to have to go back and figure out what the heck that is. Yeah, we still have 11 Jiggies and we found one Jinjo in this world. No, that's not what I'm looking for. Um, those are just overall Jinjos. Oh, view totals, of course, per level. We got two Jiggies in this world? Oh, the other one we just got. Well, two Jiggies in your first little run through the world isn't terrible. Although people have probably sped run this entire thing in faster than 21 minutes. So that is making me feel a little bad. There's two moves in this world? We have a lot to do. Uh, I hope as you're seeing right now, what I told you before... That Banjo Tooie is much more expansive than Banjo Kazooie. There's a lot more to do. A heck of a lot more. Um, and so we're going to get to experience a little bit more of that in the future. But for now, I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. If you did, make sure you subscribe. Oh, the kids just got home. You're going to get to hear some screaming. If you did enjoy, make sure you subscribe to become a citizen of Playcrastination today. And if you know anybody that you think would be a great Playcrastinator, go ahead and send them all by because we'd love to have them. But with that, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to stay on this because I think it's safe, and I will see you guys next time.